Okay. Okay, we'll demonstrate a uh, starting of the automation, starting the robot. Take our six inch cassette. Uh, notice the on, on this end effector, the H bar is facing out, H bar out. And it just loads right in place, hangs on the two hangers. Uh, from there, we, we should make sure that our robot is in a home state. If not, you need to power it up and home it. Um, so in this case we are, we're already homed, and if we want to demonstrate that we could just hit home again, it's going to go through its motion, and will tell us, there it is, it's moving theta, and this normally takes a few seconds, there it is, so RTM, well, there it is, RTM home. Alright, so from here we're going to load our recipe, and we'll just pick test one and we should see it say in the top left the recipe loading once that goes away we can hit the start button and it shows you up top which recipe or sequence we have selected which is test one from there we'll hit the start button and the robot should take off and it's laid out the same way the bench is laid out the same way the screen is so our, our PT2 is the uh, right tank QDR in the middle and our PT1 is the left side so you can you can sort of get an onboard screenshot here of what's going on it's got our time right now in another five seconds it's gonna be done with the tank process and this recipe is designed set up right now to do with like a shake off we can keep that or delete it either way so from there it's going to go to our QDR and if you want to actually get go to select QDR you can see all the steps that is going on right now it's filling spraying you'll see when the dump valve opens Now it's filling from the bottom. We have more of a quick QDR recipe right now, uh, so we won't get the feel, the, the full level there. <clears throat> so within two seconds, it should be finished with this recipe. And we also have it set to do a little shake off above the QDR, which again we can get rid of that if 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 we need to. Now it's going to PT1. Uh, this recipe is set up for 30 seconds. And again, you can select the tank if you really want to see everything that's going on. All of our temperature controllers here are only really for reference. Uh, this controller is just monitoring the actual temperature, which is process temperature, but the temperature controller is really driven by our temperature watt lows here on the panel. And always close to get back to the main menu. And once the whole cycle, the, the sequence is complete, our done button down here should go yellow. And this is going to take another minute. Uh, QDR is going to take another 60 seconds.
Okay, so 